Welcome to this video against Four Border. Uh, another Slav. We just had a Slav defense, and yeah, let's just take here. So Bishop F5, I think, is a good move here. Let's see if he plays G6. I think G6 is very good because, um, well, is it the same opponent that I played before? No. Or is it? I'm not sure. So the game before, we had uh, had the same position uh, with black castling and playing h6. Okay, let's just keep continuing to develop. Alright, we threaten to take here now, and <laughs> it's uh, like a déjà vu, so, well, yeah, g4 again, right? Let's do this. Is it the same opponent? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. It was also round two. No, I think he was stronger, 2250 or something. So, yeah, very rare occasion that you have, um, after 10 moves, uh, like the same position. And as you can see, Black also tries for the same thing that he plays with c5, but in this case he doesn't open up the position. Um, okay. But we can open up the position with g5 now. And I think we are quicker. What I also threaten now is just simply taking him on d5. Or is he arguing that uh, I cannot take because of bishop b7 and then this knight is hanging but I just play e4 right hmm yeah knight d5 is possible but you know what I first push here. I want to open up the lines here as quick as possible. I can also take on uh, on, on b5 uh, if I want to, but I don't want to make it easier for him to attack my, my king. So uh, I like to keep um, keep the position closed here at the, at the queen side and I want to attack here now on the king. Bishop b7. Hmm. Yeah, he is also quick now, but playing b4. So it's time to make some, uh, yeah. Some moves like e4 maybe. I mean, if I play rook, uh, king b1, he plays b4. I need to move my knight, and then he plays b3. Very annoying. Um, Wow, so should I sacrifice a knight here and play bishop h6? He takes, I take. Okay, but let's retreat the knight.
So it's either he wins here the attack, or it's me winning attack uh, against his king. Um, yeah, he opens up the the C file. Yeah, this looks uh, strong. But maybe I just switch now to uh, to 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 get rid of the pieces here. So don't attack anymore, but try to exchange queens and shield my king as good as possible. The C file is open, so Black was very quick now, and I think it was very good what he played. He, he opened up lines against my king. I mean, a pawn is not important in this kind of position at all. Um, yeah. It's uh, he's threatening also to take here maybe. Very, 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 very tough now. I think I just exchanged some pieces here. Okay, let's try to bring over the rook here to c3. It's important to have s some defenders of a3 and, and, and so on. Okay, here I just take. He can take on f5, um, but I have to check here. Um, hmm. Threatening knight c6, but he can play queen b5, maybe. Um. Wow, very, 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 very tough here. If I play knight c3, queen a1. Hmm. Knight c6, he, he just takes and takes the bishop here but do I have a check maybe bishop f6 and then here yeah I will try this so I think he will play uh, bishop d3 now and I have totally overlooked this one um, hmm. Yeah, this game is lost. Queen a1 I would play. Yes, indeed. Yeah, it's um I can give this up. Resign. All right, very well played by Black. Um but where did I go wrong? So rook e h e four. I all I like all these moves. Yeah, and black is very quick now on the queen side. Maybe I should just take here on on d five or even on b five. I didn't want to open up um, the position at the at the queen side, but. Um, well, I think it's. It's just best to do this. So taking on d5 now, and uh, afterwards f6, and then I push for d5. Yeah, and I think I'm much better. So this is what I did wrong. And here you could see just that black was very very quick on the on the queen side. I mean here threatens to play b4 and taking on a2, and. Um, 
Yeah, I, I still dreamt, dreamt, dreamt about attacking him here, but I was just too slow. And this, yeah, this this cannot be good for, for White. I mean, he just opens everything on the queen side. Um, yeah, I needed to, to take this pawn just to hope to survive. But I think he... Yeah, this was all quite good. Um, but I think still he needs to do some resources. And... Um, I mean, I just need to take here on c8, I guess, get rid of this bishop, and um, then play rook to uh, c3 afterwards when he takes here. Um, and it should be okay for me. So here I also went wrong because I, I just played too quickly on f6. I thought he needs to take back because I attacked g7, but yeah, for sure, uh, bishop f5 was just a horrible pin here. So. Um, yeah, I need to bit more uh, to take a bit more time here. So, as you can see in this game, um, it's very very important in such situ situations to to open up lines against the king. So, uh, as in the game before, where I succeeded on the king side because I was quick in opening lines, black was here quick to open lines, and this is uh, the the name of the game, so to say, open lines and who is quicker even with sacrificing pawns. Uh, is the one who often wins in such kind of positions. Thanks for watching.